Hello, everybody. Um, welcome to uh, Zach's channel. I'm Will. I'm one of Zach's friends. And uh, today we are apparently talking about what corrupted uh, Nickelodeon. Hey, guys. What's up? <laughs> I did not see you there. Yeah, no, this camera. <laughs> hey, guys. What's up? So we're talking about what ruined Nickelodeon. Yeah. I mean, we all we all know of Nickelodeon shows like iCarly, Victorious, um, those type of shows that everyone watch as like a kid. And, and um, for me, I think what really ruined Nickelodeon is SpongeBob Surprise. Yes, I, I don't. I, I don't think that the the older versions of SpongeBob were were not that bad because. Like, they were funny, you could watch them, like, I, in my opinion, I thought that it should have been on Cartoon Network. Right. Because then, again, then, like, Cartoon... And surprisingly, what also ruined Nickelodeon is, and I'm going to bring out this giant twist, is that they were given the option to take Adventure Time. Right. And they, they didn't. Yeah, and they didn't, and now, and had they have taken Adventure Time and put them at Nickelodeon... I think that they would have actually have t done a really good job, and they would have been able to boost their thing back. But they thought Adventure Time wasn't that good. Right. It's almost like in in the 1980s, how um, this guy declined um, a thing to um, appear in Apple. He, um, so had he have been able to be a part of Apple with Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak, he would have been a billionaire. Right. And um, now he's telling his accomplishments for $27. I say, so, I guess we so wait, well, as far as uh, Spongebob you. goes, you're right. It, it you. got corrupted after the third season. I mean, with the with all the stuff that... After what season? Third season. <laughs> uh, after the fifth <laughs> season, in my opinion. Yeah, fifth. I go later. Yeah, I, I would go later. I'm surprised that they're at its ninth season. Well, and Nickelodeon's <laughs> golden age was Rocco's Modern Life. After yeah. that, it really started going down. Yeah. Remember Ed, Ed, and Eddie? Yeah, a cartoon network. Ed, Ed, and Eddie. All right, that was so amazing. I would, I would watch that every night when I was a kid. Here's what we're doing after this. After we talk about corruption, we're going to talk about golden ages uh, and what what's great about these channels. The high times, like Ed, Ed, and Eddie, the best TV shows. What do you think? Of? I'm sorry, what was the last part? I said we'll talk about the best TV shows after we finish this series. What the greatest TV shows were and what really made these shows. Like yeah, them. absolutely. Like great cartoon shows, great. Good. I mean, what kind of shows do you uh, de define as? Or like any type of shows? Any, yeah. You well, like you know what? Comment below what your favorite TV show or channel is and maybe we'll talk about it tomorrow. And we'll see you. And we'll see you tomorrow. No, they won't.